Hey everybody, this is Dorico again doing another video on my Palm Pre. I'm going to go over a little bit of tweaks that I added to the Palm Pre. Um, the tweaks that I added was a theme um, that you could get at pre-themer.com. Um, they have right now about 16 themes right now currently. Uh, I like the Ultimate Blue one, I believe it's called, or Ultra Blue. So that's why I kept turns your icons blue at the bottom and so forth. I think that's pretty nifty. Uh, the things I also added that I got from PreCentral.net. Um, if you haven't subscribed to it or If you ever subscribe to PreCentral.net and you got a Palm Pre, you're basically um, dumb almost. Uh, <laughs> I'm just joking. Uh, PreCentral.net has a lot of information about uh, the Pre, uh, the devices coming out for accessories, the software for it, and a lot of tweets and mods you can do. It. Um, just the other day, I rooted the Palm Pre in order to use it as a phone, as a modem. Um, currently, right now, in the place I have, I don't have the internet so what I did was download an application called my teether app and it actually turns your phone as a modem and it's pretty cool I actually love it right now uh, see right now it's turned off but it's called USB tearing and right now as you can see on my computer I'm not hooked up to any network right now. You don't see a little globe or anything right now. Uh, if I was to go to a web page, you'll see that. So, go to my pre, turn this application on, because I want to be able to use the internet. So turn it on and enable DHCP basically generates a IP address so my phone can know that I have a USB to see it as a USB uh, modem actually so that's pretty cool um, Sprint used to be able to walk you through how to use it as a modem but for some reason they took that away um, their other phones have a $15 charge for that, to do that. So I think that's what they're going to try to add, is you pay $15 so you can use your phone as a modem. But why do that when you got lovely people that make software for you to do things for free? <laughs> uh, on my pre, what else do I got? I added launchers, uh, a new launcher pages. You currently get three at a time uh, I didn't like that I put five on there let's show this my one two three four and five so I got five launchers you also notice my icons are smaller I did my icons four by four I really didn't like scrolling up and scrolling down when it came to looking at apps and games to select. So I made the launch, the I um, tweaked it so that my icons are four by four. It makes it smaller, the icons, but I like it that way. Um, also made it that the silent, I silenced the phone dial pad and put it with a vibrating feedback. Instead of making the noise, of course, when you dial a number, it just gives you feedback. I think that's pretty cool. I did messaging forwarding and email forwarding with the web quick OS. The web OS quick install. It's a pretty quick, cool tweaks to do on there as well. Okay show you a couple of them that you could do so 
so there's a whole list of them you could do. You could check that out in your time. Uh, make this short and sweet for you. Uh, so I also changed my battery icon to a percentage. I know you can't see it, but it's not a icon anymore. Uh, I didn't like guessing what my battery was. I just like having the percentage there, so I can definitely know. Uh, some other things I added, of course, are fully videos to my Palm Pre. I do that for all my smartphones. Uh, let's check out one that you get on here. The Hangover. I love the Hangover. That's why I put it on my Palm Pre. Of course, we're not going to wash it. So, download full movies. How do I do that to convert it? Uh, let me see. It's called Video. Video or Palm Pre. There we go. Um, it's basic converter. I googled it, but it's V I D E O. O, I'm sorry, V I D E O R A. Video Palm Pre Converter. You can convert real full length movies to your Palm Pre and actually works very well. Great quality, great sound. Um, as you can see now that my tear thing is on, I have the internet connection back again. So, if I wanted to go to another web page, there we go. So, that's pretty cool. I said, if you have a laptop, you could turn this into a Wi Fi router. Um, there's also Wi Fi tiering on there. Or if you have a desktop or even a laptop as well, you can turn it to a UB USB tearing and use it as a phone as modal. I said a feature that Sprint is trying to get you to pay $15 for, but as long as they don't find out, you get it for free per month. <laughs> uh, one thing I also added, of course, uh, that I definitely wanted was a auto rotate when it comes to emails and text messaging and also of course on screen keyboard that I also got how to do this on precentral.net So, this is definitely cool to have. It works on web pages too, and as you see that I just did, also works on landscape mode. Uh, you just have to do the tweak to enable email landscape and messaging landscape, or of course it's not going to do it for you. So, that's pretty cool. And of course, this is operating on the 1.1 web OS, not the 1.2. So, a couple of things that I did. If you want to check out more stuff, I suggest that you go to pre-themer.com uh, and also precentral.net. Look at some tweaks and some things that you could do with the phone. And also buy a standard battery. I went on eBay, 15 bucks. Get extra battery, people. All right, that's Rico. Over and out.